we're heading into Target for a little toy hunting. We'll see what we can find. You ready? You ready to go to Target? So those are the basics, but if you want the most powerful character, you need to build a combo. Okay. So, let's... Oh. Oi there, matey! Uh, oh, hey, Captain Blockbeard. I'm, uh, trying to do a video here. Yar, pick me, pick me! To scan you into Six City, Yar. we just point the camera at your figure, and boom, you're in the game! Yar, baby! So here at Target, they have a four-pack of minions based on the movie. And they have the little figures as well. Those are cute. I like those. So the six pack of the little figures is forty dollars. There are the individual ones. This is cool. It's a flying minion. Flying heroes. Though we don't have much luck when it comes to anything flying, so. Hi, Tegan. It's me again. Are you going to see my movie in cinemas this Friday? I absolutely love these little play school heroes. This one is the Stegosaurus, but it comes with a dinosaur and a person. And they move. Let's try and do this one handed here. Push down on his spine. Oh, Tegan's trying to help. And he moves. Yeah. Isn't that cool? They have more around the corner. I'll have to go go show you more. They're neat. Check out this poor uh, head drop in Leonardo. Oh, where's his head? Where's his leg? Somebody broke oh, off his oh, leg. Oh. He doesn't have a head or a leg. Poor Leo. Oh. Here we have a section for the Play School Heroes Jurassic World stuff. It is so cool. Look at this guy. Oops. Yeah, and this one is so cool. I don't want to do it to Tegan again because I think he was going to cry, but... They have these little guys too that just the dinosaur and no person with them and they have a little movement too it's so cool <laughs> yeah get me away from those dinosaurs mom <laughs> yeah <laughs> the dinosaurs have taken over target <sighs> they got the ones you can mix up the parts of the dinosaurs <laughs> they have the cut the jeep i like hero mashers those are kind of cool they're neat. Ben, watch out over there. Look. Ah. Oh, he's just shopping. He's okay. Okay. <laughs> Phew. <laughs> you you going to record some toy hunts, bud? <laughs> yeah, you're recording. You got to you got to aim it. You got <laughs> to aim it like this. Like that. I think this is a first. There is nothing in our cart. I don't believe it. We aren't buying anything. <gasps> <laughs> you want to go somewhere else, buddy? Next up, Toys R Us. There's the wall of Toys R Us. Can't see the sign from here. <laughs> We're not really expecting anything new, but you never know, right? We didn't find anything at Target. Let's see if we find anything in there. Hopefully. Hopefully, fingers crossed. And this is a cool hotel. There's two of them. There are two round towers. Oh, yeah. Isn't that cool? We're actually going to be staying at this hotel one of these nights this summer, one of our trips back and forth from the airport. Yeah, because the airport's like an hour away from our house. So when we get back late, we don't want to drive an hour to get home. Because we're we, going to stay there. Yeah, we've never been there before. No, they're, it's round. How cool is that going to be? Check out all this inside out stuff. 
we haven't seen like any of this before. No. We saw these previously. Yeah, these yeah, talking yeah. dolls. Yeah. Well, let's see what it all does, okay, guys? Cotton candy scent. <laughs> Not as strong as the Disney Store version. Okay, so I squeeze my legs. They're quiet. Press my tie. Whoa. Yeah. That's cool. I like these, uh, the pop figures of Disgust and Sadness. They don't have any others. Yeah, Look at these little, little figures up here. They're not little, little. They're four, what, maybe like four inches or so. They have fear, anger, joy, disgust, sadness, and um, they have a two pack of these little, little tiny ones. Bing Bong and Fear. And they also have joy and disgust small ones those are cool look at this little opius elephant oh my gosh this is adorable there's a bobblehead elephant and then a little itty bitty elephant and it comes with a little bottle look at they have a little puppy dog and a kitty cat or a tiger i'm not really sure maybe both poodle and a little piggy is that a little piggy oh <gasps> it is it's a little piggy oh look Aww. oh here's the back of the cart shows everybody Oh, they are adorable. You're gonna have to mail in and get that zebra. I know. We are gonna have to mail in and get that zebra, huh, buddy? You want Mama to get that? Okay. Well, Mama will get some stuff to get that. Hi, John. Hello. Those are adorable. No fashions. Aww. Darn. We actually saw one okay. lonely fashion in a box of Mario blind bags back in the late yeah. section, so back I'll have to go back and grab that. Also, guys, not cool. Not cool at all. That's Mama's favorite wrestler, too. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Are we going to get some coins? We got an extra life. Can you hit it? I guess we're hitting it wrong. You need to punch it from the bottom like this. <laughs> New minion blind bags? Yep, I'll get a couple of these. Okay. Spike might want those. Yep. So we got some of that. <laughs> so awesome. Cute. Okay. They're very quiet. I'm sadness. I don't think that'll work. That's sad. Mom, you're on. He's, oh, miss he's missing a hand. Let's not panic, people. Oh, <laughs> Poor fear. Go see magic. We're gonna go see Jurassic World in IMAX 3D. It's gonna be like the dinosaurs are jumping into our lap. We're so excited. It's gonna be me <laughs> when I see a dinosaur hopping out of the screen. <laughs> no, it's more gonna it's gonna be more of you jumping back going. Ah! <laughs> okay, we're gonna go in. I want more nachos. And we're going to go see Jurassic World! So we're on the road looking for some yard sales. It's a beautiful Saturday morning today, isn't it, Ben? It is gorgeous out. Hi! So what did you think of Jurassic World? I give it two big Jurassic claws up. We loved it. I, I thought it was really, really good. Probably not recommended for the little ones. No. There's lots of dino action. Yeah, there was a lot of dino action. Might be a little scary. You might go like some, this. Some chomping. Ah! Yeah, lots of dino chomping. chomping. So we're out on out and about looking for yard sales. We'll see if we find anything today. Hopefully we find something good. And Tegan's with us. Hi. Say hi, bud. 
<laughs> okay guys, we are at what is called the Hayward Club, I guess. I think they they named it themselves. But anyway, seven miles of different yard sales up and down this road. So um, Tegan is with us. So John is walking this little stretch. I don't know, he's back there somewhere. You can see in the rear view all those yard sales down there. Um, John is walking through some of the yard sales right now and he's gonna meet me up down here. I just bought a vintage suction cup Garfield for <gasps> 50 cents. Oh my goodness! I'm climbing the walls for you. So now our car, he matches our car. It does. <laughs> so uh, now we can have a Garfield hanging in our window. Awesome! <laughs> so I'll hand him to you. I'm gonna keep walking up the road, okay? Okie dokie. All right, I'm back again. I got two of these. These look like homemade little shelves. I thought those would be good for our Funko uh, mystery minis and vinyl nations and stuff. Yeah, that'll be great. Just need to dust them off. I got two of those. And I found this big canvas. Awesome. Uh, thing of Pluto. We have Mickey and Donald. Yeah. So now we have Pluto too. Yay. That was $8 and those were Four dollars a piece, so I spent sixteen dollars. A little pricey for yard sale, but I figured it was I'd never see him again. Yeah, that's true. Awesome. Load him in the trunk. Yep. Okay, we are still working on the yard sailing. And John is back there. There's a couple oh, you can see him. There's a couple yard sales back there that he is checking out. Um we've gone a couple miles. We haven't seen a lot. We've been kind of striking out. But we're still looking. And I think we still have a couple more miles to go in this yard sale. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi. You like yard sailing? Eh, it's all right. You're just in the car, huh? Dada come in? Is Dada here? Dada is here. It struck out again. I think I, I think I found all my stuff at the beginning of the seven miles. <laughs> Whew. All well, right. We're going to keep going. Yep. We'll see if there's any more. If not, we'll head to the other town. Yep, there's a couple big ones right next to each other in another town. Yeah. Not spread out over the course of seven miles. No. All right, but let's see if we can end this seven mile stretch with something cool. Some okay. good treasures. All right, I found two grab bags. We'll get in the car and we'll open them up. Should we do this now or wait? Tease it out for a separate video when we get home. Ooh. Ooh. Let's wait. We're gonna keep you guys in suspense. Okay. But as you know, if if you're a loyal Ben's Toy Bin fan, you know we cannot resist yard sale mystery <laughs> junk bag. That's right. So okay, so we will wait and we'll open that up later on a separate video. Stay tuned. So we're home after yard sailing. We're gonna show you our haul here. You've seen some of it as we've been unloading it. Here's a better look at the Pluto canvas drawing. These were sold at the Disney store. I actually have a Fantasia Mickey one and a Donald one on the wall, but we don't have Pluto, so that's pretty cool. Pluto looks a little mean, though. This is a different version, right? Because your Donald and your Mickey, they have other sketches around Yeah, behind them. them yeah. Behind them. But it is very similar. Yeah. Probably the coolest thing we found today, we originally thought this was a bookend without the other bookend, but Ben looked at the bottom, and this is actually, this is actually from Spider-Man 3. This is a Diamond Select Toys bust. And look how low the limited edition number is. This is number 14 out of 5,000. And we paid $2 for it. <laughs> the only thing... The only thing wrong with it, Ben noticed, was that a couple of Spidey's fingers are bent up here. So we're going to look online and see what this went for originally. Yeah. I'm sure it was more than $2. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Here are our two mystery grab bags. We'll have to open those soon. We're going to have to clean this up, but we found this Fisher-Price table. This makes noises and stuff. And this, it doesn't have batteries in it right now, but we're gonna fix it up and that's gonna be for Tegan. We paid $2 for that. We found a Care Bear Cousin Penguin, a vintage one. We paid a dollar for him and he's in like perfect shape. I don't know the penguin's name from Care Bears, do you? No, I don't. Do you guys know the penguin's name? Let us know. And you may have seen Tegan carrying around this guy on Instagram. We paid a dime for this one. And again, I'm not sure who this one is. Is it Share Bear? It might be. Is that Share Bear? So that was our yard sale haul. Should we open those grab bags now? Let's do it while we're out here. What do you think, guys? Okay, we'll open it. Let's go to... Whoa, extreme Tegan close-up. Let's go to the picnic table and open those grab bags. Summer! <laughs> okay, Ben. 
Pick a grab bag. I'll take this one. Okay, is this gonna be trash or treasure? Let's find out. Okay, grab bag. What do we get? It's been a while since we found any mystery grab bags at the yard sales. Okay. Oh, you got a minion. Oh, oh I got to blow into it. I'm not no. blowing into that. <laughs> no, we'll, we won't blow there, into that. There are bite marks on it, so I am not going to be blowing into that. But anyway, here's a minion. Um, a glow in the dark cannon. cannon. Cool. Looks like it's on upside down. I don't know what this is from. I don't know what it's from, but there's a cannon that I think glows in the dark. Oh, oh it's the Hamburglar. So sweet. And he like has a Halloween mask on. That is awesome. Okay, and I got some littles in here. Okay. Um, random crayons. Got some crayons. I got a... Is that a swordfish? Swordfish, I think. A lizard, or something similar. A scorpion, and a single one of those barrel of monkey monkeys. Yes. All right. Well, I think Hamburglar and the Minion are the stars of yours. I think so. All right. I'm going to hand that off to you. Okay. Oh, my bag got wet. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, first up, I have Simon. Oh. Does he do anything? I don't think he does. I think does. he's missing a piece. Maybe it's in the bag. Okay, I got a Santa Claus <laughs> operating <laughs> a uh, bulldozer slash uh, excavator. Is that what it's called? Yeah. And then I also have the crayon bug and I have some necklace beads. Whew. Well, you guys are going to have to let us know who got the better grab bag. I have to, I have to say Ben. I got the better one. Yeah, just for Hamburglar. He even has a spider on his tongue. That is so cool. Looks like he had something in him at one point. Yeah. Awesome. But let us know down in the comments. I, I probably just swayed the vote in yep. uh, Bin's favor. Hashtag Team Bin.